is kind of an awkward. We're oh, kind of the fantastic bounce. three here. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> Let's get this party started. Use all our good jokes up already. Well, it's, but it's recording, uh, so yeah. If you consider that a good joke. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what the funniest joke was. Fantastic Four. Bumper. So we just got done seeing the Fantastic Four. Uh, we went against the odds. You know, it has 9% on Rotten Tomatoes. Uh, it slipped to 8, I think, today. Okay, 27% fan uh, percentage, so it's not doing well. And uh, I think that 27 is pretty solid for it. 27% yeah. is about where it belongs. Let's break down the characters. Who do we got in this? Uh, we got Reed Richards, the, what's the, he's super stretch. Yeah, Stretch Armstrong stretch guy. Armstrong. We, we got, got uh, Suzanne Summers. Yep. Um, Invisible Girl. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be Jordan playing and, the Human Torch. You know, we talked about this off camera, but I get if the director who did Chronicle, which uh, I enjoyed quite a bit, I know the critics did, but now for some reason everybody just hates it online. Like it's cool to jump on the because of the director. Or, well, because of this film being bad, so like, yeah, Chronicle sucked too. Maybe I it wasn't as good it. as they thought. Yeah. Um, but I get if the director was like. Michael B. Jordan was so good. We are gonna recreate this character as a as a black kid because you know fuck the hundreds of years of comics or however long it's gone. This is the guy, but he didn't do anything. He was very underutilized in the film, so it just made no sense. It was stunt casting and nothing more. I thought he had good, clever, like subtle humor. <laughs> please go. Uh, please elaborate. There was a time when he was on a chair and kind of like bounced <laughs> down just to kind of break the tension. Oh, um, that's the joke in the trailer, and that's like two jokes in the film, and it's not even a joke. It's just he's just going down, doesn't have any. And I wouldn't say he's not like a ha ha like throwing out jokes. He's just kind of a high flying like. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> talk about the effects on him and how just uh, his just poor they better, were though. They got better. They got better, better at the end. Yeah, well, those effects got better, but everything else just went out the window. You're talking about the fire the effects. Fire. <laughs> so going in, I had zero interest. That's where my gauge was at, uh, between one and a thousand. The yeah, gauge was at zero. I was hoping to go to Southpaw tonight, but... Well, you're kind of off camera. Why don't you just peekaboo in a little bit more? And Drew's kinda... not in the middle. Like, well, I, I didn't, didn't want to block Drew's him, like, him and I've got this. The, the, the I small. Too small. Well, there is a perspective thing. I'm just kind of loving this camera. It's oh, I don't know if I'll use that. Oh, okay. So that's the GoPro. That's, that's the second shot. Mm -hmm. This is a very professionally made, well-crafted show. <laughs> um, doctor, yeah, so Kate Mara was one of the only reasons I wanted to see this, just to see her in her little outfits doing well, her invisible. She really didn't do much. No, she didn't do anything either. There so. wasn't like a scandalous, like, come out of the cryo chamber in a bikini. <laughs> 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 oh, hey, boys. <laughs> Speaking of the cryo chambers, that shit's just bouncing back and forth towards the end like yeah. it's nothing. Like, <laughs> like, they just cue that thing up. It took decades to get <laughs> to, this, build to, this. to build this. He comes in, reprograms it in 10 minutes. They're <laughs> jumping back and forth. It's, it's, like making a, it's like making a hot pocket and the thing's there and back already. And yeah. I love how a lot of the uh, the battles or like the action is, it is very PG-13, except for the scene where Doctor Doom walks through and blood splatters. That was off. Awesome. That was one of the only <laughs> cool things. And I bet there was a lot more of that, but if the director was in fighting with the studio with Fox so much. Why don't you just like move up? <laughs> I don't like, know. No, no, just like lean awkwardly forward like you're That's the shining better. or something. Yeah, there now, you go. Now touch my shoulder. Yeah, now no, rub my <laughs> shoulder in his at the same time. <laughs> the fighting in this is really bad. There's like two scenes in total. A total of maybe five minutes, and like some of the best parts are like I'm a, not even sure a stretch yeah. punch. Like, <laughs> that it's, was so bad. Like, <laughs> it's like no creativity. It's no. Like, let's they may not be able to take one of us, but can they take all, all four, four of us? Yeah. yeah, I was calling or line. We were calling lines that. out yeah, during yeah, the movie. Yeah. But there's no choreography. No. There's nothing creative. There's a fight in the woods that lasts all of seven seconds. <laughs> Reed Richards takes out three guys with stretch powers, and then the thing comes down and headbutts him, and that's the entire that's the entire battle. That was probably the most disappointing part of the entire Fantastic yeah. Four movie was there wasn't enough action. I didn't mind like the the intro, like the, the first thirty minutes, like the yeah, build up, the background up. story. That was all right. Then you're expecting, okay, well let's get into some battle scenes, and it's pretty lackluster. Yeah, we're ragging on it a lot, but the first I'd say 30, 40 minutes is is pretty good. They he's slowly building up the the story. He's focusing on the science aspect, which was kind of cool, and it's it was refreshing. The problem is. 
it started out a lot smarter than it really was. And by the end, you're just shaking your head the entire time. Like, this is what we built up for this stupid generic fight that we've seen a million times much better in other films. Dr. Doom looked terrible. Yeah. He looked nothing like he does in the comic books or even the last movie did him better than that. He looked yeah, he was he looked gross. <laughs> he wore a mask in the old ones because he was ashamed of how he looked because he was a really pretty boy. Okay. You know, his looks were part of his image, so he he didn't want people to see him. So he wore a mask and he wore the hood. But in this one, he was like an environmentalist freak show. He didn't give a shit about looks. The thing that I don't get is they he, went back to save him. He appeared to want to be saved, came back. Just to slaughter everybody to go back and like suck <laughs> the entire world in. How dare you come into my world? Now I'm coming into yours. <laughs> he was limping and then he just, he just, yeah, he just don't, back don't worry in about that. No, I like, I just like how you put the hood on. Why do you put the hood on? Dude? Where did he get the hood? <laughs> He's embarrassed. He's embarrassed. Just grab your jacket over there, like, yeah, like this. <laughs> that was as dumb as Transformers. Was it Transformers 3 when uh, Megatron's wearing the scarf in the desert? Yeah. <laughs> He's a robot! <laughs> you know, Marvel was able to step in to Ant-Man and craft a great film out of, you know, a messy production and, you know, director feedback. And, and not much of a following to the comic, I don't think, no, at the time. No, yeah. Fox had a popular property, and they managed to just screw the hell out of it. Anyway, let's give this a review. This has gone on far. This might be longer than the movie itself. Um, <laughs> Thank God. Yeah, I'm going to give this a... I'm not going to go easy. Uh, I'm going to go three. I'm going to double up on that and go... Three. Trice. Uh, I'll go four. Oh. I, I, I didn't think it was as bad as You're really taking as that the critics say. Well, we, we neither did <laughs> we when we jumped in with that 30%. Yeah. 30% seems fair. I mean, you're just throwing out a four just to be generous. It doesn't 10%. need your I guess I don't feelings want to be the aren't same hurt. You guys. Oh, uh, wow. I, I respect that. I, yeah. Uh, okay, well, till next like the time. The price is right. Oh, okay. I'm not going to end this, I guess. So, till the next time, we'll, we'll see you in the. <laughs> <laughs> Till next time we'll see you in the car. I say that now.